Well, my name is Norman Thornworth. I used to be a play to elder at Torrich Castings. When I first started, it was all a steam train, you know, and all that. There was all a, a lot of asbestos then, you know, off the steam trains, because all the boilers was covered with asbestos, you know. He lived at work. He used to do weekends. He used to be on days and nights. He, and then they would ask him to work weekends and he never refused them. He worked with his twin brother, Harold. He liked where he worked. He liked his job. Really, really did. We went to his brother's funeral and I was talking to his wife and I was telling her about Norman coughing. And she said, oh, that was what Harold had, Carol. I think it's about four years when I went writing on that. They showed me a, a photograph, what they took up, you know, lungs, and the white dot all around my lungs, you know. There are quite a few different businesses where one could be exposed to asbestos, such as boiler makers, welders, joiners, construction workers, electricians. Asbestos only got banned in the UK in 1999, so any building that has asbestos means that one is at risk of getting exposure to it. Asbestos is a very complex type of a case. We would recommend clients to always contact solicitors as because that will allow the individual to focus on other important matters in their life and allow us to deal with the matter with the care and consideration it deserves. Mr Farnworth's case was slightly complex because after we carried out investigations in terms of who the defendants were and we communicated with them, they weren't forthcoming in terms of a liability decision. After we served the court documents, it transpired that the medical evidence confirmed it was asbestos. Sadly also confirmed that he had a life expectancy reduced, which meant that our priority then was to try and get settlement reached as soon as possible so that Mr Farnworth can recover some damages and hopefully use it to enjoy some quality of life. I'm on a monthly benefit and uh, they got me a lump sum. What I got, uh, I get to the families. They definitely appreciated it. They couldn't, they couldn't thank me so much enough. No, no, no problems with it. Very easy, very easy talking to them. They put me on the right path, I should think. I'd recommend anybody to get in touch with them. Stevenson's been great, you know. Really have. Been, they've been fabulous. I'll pour out that road.